Hello! It's San Hello. there's Santa Hello. here, but he's he looks remarkably boring. Wait, wait, when he's not Santa. Did, angry. did we speak yeah. to this man? We spoke to this man. We, we, we yes, have we spoke to this man. Uh, I feel like the only thing you had to do at this point was probably go talk to Edgeworth again and just be like, Let me be your freaking attorney! Hey, right, stop being a little bastard! What I'm gonna be your Edge fucking boy? attorney! Listen to me right now! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, let's go. Listen, Edge boy. Do you want to go to prison? No, I will be Get your over your weird, today. prideful bullshit and just let me be your fucking attorney! Okay, okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I, okay, I'm sorry, man. Okay, I was wrong. Cool. Nice. He's not there. <laughs> Maybe he's just hiding out of the chair. Edgy. Edgy. Police station. <laughs> police station. Okay. Okay. Police station. Not a gumshoe in sight. Oh, it's a Christmas miracle. There we go. <laughs> if you're looking for Detective Gumshoe, he's in the questioning room. Apparently an important witness turned up. Shit, okay. I forgot! Shit, uh, shit, shit, shit! Uh, <clears throat> <clears throat> okay, thank you. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm good. Tourette's. We'll be in there a while. Uh. What a heart. It has to be. <sighs> Why do I always? T and this is—I didn't even take it on a case yet. I can't say that. This isn't my case. I'm just doing it out of the kindness of my heart, quote unquote. Uh oh. All right. Well, let's go. Let's go admire the blue demon over here. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that thing. Look at that. Gotta go first. <laughs> 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 Dem demonic Sonic. Oh, where's my inhaler? Oh, shit. I don't know where it is. He says it's a badger, but it doesn't look like a badger. <laughs> and this is how Brute dies. Come on. <laughs> how many do I have left? 45. I need a new inhaler. Now that I've almost killed our person recording the video. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, now that our, our would-be protagonist is almost though. dead. Yeah, this happens all the time. Yeah. yeah, yeah, I mean, like, I I am convinced that this is legitimately how Brute will die. Well, half the problem is I'm always sick and, you know, trouble yeah. breathing plus asthma equals problems. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, <laughs> thank god you're not living down here right now. There's this red tide BS going right going oh. on right now, and it's even affecting like me and my mom. Uh, yeah. I'm glad. <laughs> I'm not Yes. And here there's like wildfires and the smoke is getting trapped in the valley, so it's like you go out and you smell something burning. I it's live like, oh. I live in the Midwest by the river, so humidity fucks me. Yeah. Oh. What is it? Oh. Nothing. Just something's been bothering me. So, when you say nothing, you actually mean everything. And you're nothing. lying to me. <laughs> Bad kids Do don't get gifts from Santa. need to get you a waterfall? Nothing. Bad kids you're who lie get coal. Kids who lie get coal, damn you. Do you want coal for Christmas? No. And what's bothering you? Could you show me that autopsy report once more? I guess. Mm. Hey! I, I remember now! This guy! This is a lawyer that was at that office Mia worked at. I met him once when he went there to hang out with- when I went there to hang out with Sis. You hung out with her at her job as a lawyer? Yeah. Sounds- hideously boring and I'm a lawyer <laughs> that's how she met you she came to my office no <laughs> she met me because her sister was dead in her office which is now my office 
Yeah, she went to hang out with her sister. Oh my god, my sister is dead. I'm pretty Did sure she's hung out with her sister open. more than once, but... <laughs> 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 that office? Wait. You mean Grossberg's office? Right, that guy. Oh no, I don't want to talk to him. That was the last name I expected to come up. Maybe I should go talk to him, for old time's sake. I forgot to go like look up a video and see if it was that photo that was at his office before. Because I know there was a photo that we saw that was like not the one that pertained to yeah. the case we were on. Yeah. It's just still the they never painted over the the, the yeah, paint. yeah, they never painted over or or, or <laughs> put another something. painting up. I mean, come on, Ghostbusters. I hear them. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, oh, that old familiar clearing of the throat. How oh, are you, Mia's something, are you not? Honestly, pick any word you want, it's probably accurate. That was her understudy, yes. Phoenix Wright. Oh, and you, you're Mia's uh, something too, are you not? We call that Mia's baggage. Hey! Oof. <laughs> My little sister, yes. Baggage, yep. Stomps on foot. Ow! You grown! Mmm! <laughs> I'm just gonna scoot over here, don't worry about it. Eh? It's just... It's go. You've come to look a lot like your sister, you know. Um... Hey, I saw there was a vending machine in the front, why don't you... Go... Stare at it, I don't know. It takes me back. Ah, the days of my youth. Like the scent of fresh lemon. You see? What? Huh? <laughs> um, Mr. Grossberg, sir? Hmm? Ah, yes, I beg your pardon. Of course you come here to discuss something. What is it then? Something the matter? Do you not take Christmas off? Does nobody take Christmas off around here? Apparently. Everybody's working. Where on I Christmas. come from, it's practically illegal to be working on Christmas. Did he always have that little pin on his tie? I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't remember. <laughs> I'll be honest, I kinda forgot about this guy until right now. Mr. Grossberg, whatever happened to that painting? Oh, yes. I do not think it shall ever be coming back home to this office. What a shame. Oh, I can't exactly claim it as stolen. I suppose it's my just desserts. Old, bitter desserts. What if we just, like, hung up a different photo? I don't have the money for that right now. Oh, I, you don't have to tell me that twice, bud. <laughs> there was a murder last night. No murder. You haven't heard? I uh, just got up, you see. It's noon. Well, <laughs> Miles Edgeworth shot someone with a pistol. Allegedly. Sorry. Allegedly, Miles Edgeworth shot someone with a pistol. Edgeworth? What? Who? Oh. Yes. Well, the identity of the victim is still unknown. As I check all these this messages. This is terrible <laughs> news indeed. I guess he hadn't heard anything. Yeah, right, well, that's fun. Um, you ever seen an attorney's badge? It's damn beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> You've really grown up, grown up in the past few years, my dear. Hey, badge! Look at the badge. Um, I'm gonna hide behind Phoenix now. Yeah. And bless his calling Phoenix, my dear. Because I'm really gonna stop that man from do being able to get past me. Yes. <laughs> I believe in you. 
How proud Maria would be if she could see you now. See? Wholesome. Have some Christmas faith in somebody. I don't know. She said she was more worried about me than anything. Yeah. Oh, just go on and take the compliment, will ya? Um... Oh, you don't actually have the photo to show him? That's weird. Um, it's in the autopsy report. What is? The, the photo. Oh. Uh, what, do you, what do you think about this? Oh, wow, well, it works. Right. I feel as though I've seen this man somewhere before. I'm having a sense of deja vu. Ah! Oh no. Did you remember? He was a lawyer here in my office. That's Hammond. Robert Hammond. Him? Mr. Hammond? And you say this is the man Miles Edgeworth shot? Yeah, thank you. Who is this Hammond guy, anyways? Mr. Hammond? He was the defense attorney in that case. That case? Yes, the DL6 incident. Uh, I'm trying, I'm working the gears trying to remember if I've heard that before. That came up when, uh, in, back in, like, the second case, I think it had something to do with the stuff that <laughs> Red White was getting rid of evidence of, and okay. Mia had been investigating it for years, because okay. it involved her. Okay, yeah, I remember yeah. who, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. DL6? Why does that sound so familiar? No. Oh, we just at least you're in did tune with Phoenix. this again! This LP <laughs> has been me and Phoenix Wright saying remarkably similar things, and I'm honestly creeped out at this point. <laughs> Perhaps you remember? I'm sure someone mentioned it during the trial for Mia's murder. That was the incident where the police were so at a loss they used the spirit medium. Yes. Uh-oh, he said one of the serious phrases. She's gonna go all frog-faced. Wait, you don't mean... Is that me and my mother? Oh no, um, I'm not equipped to handle situations like this, bye! <laughs> yes, my dear. I'm just gonna read the paper, don't mind me. The spirit medium Misty Fay, your mother, contacted the spirit of the victim. But the case was a loss. No conviction was made. Ooh, coupons! The DL6 incident, yes, happened 15 years ago. A very strange case indeed. They never caught the criminal, right? Correct. Misty Fry used the powers to talk- uh, her powers to talk to the spirit of the late victim. Her testimony led to charges being laid against one man. But Mr. Hammond won the case, and the suspect was declared innocent. Oh. And the police blamed my mother, calling her a fraud. Suddenly the room feels really tense. <coughs> you, were, you were the one who helped her out then, right, Mr. Grossberg? Uh, yes. Yes, quite. Why does that sound like a no? Thank you! No, please, don't mention it. That looks like a face racked with guilt and cheeseburgers. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> DL6. Never thought I'd hear that name again. Wait. Waiting. What does that case have anything to do with Mr. Edgeworth? It has everything to do with Mr. Edgeworth, my dear. The victim in the DL6 incident was none other than his father, Gregory Edgeworth. Whoa! 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 
Oh, Hold oh, on oh, a second oh, here. I, I mean. Whoa. Oh, that kind of. What? His father? Surprise! <laughs> oh yeah, that mofo's guilty. Oh yeah, that mofo's guilty. Fucking guilty, dude. Forget it. I'm yeah, not yeah, defending him. More. You should ask him yourself. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Edward is guilty. Show him this. I'm sure he'll talk to you. I don't know. I'm pretty sure he's like a recurring character, so I don't think he's actually going to be guilty. Just meta knowledge, you know? Wait. Waiting. This is a photograph of my mother. Oh no. My, my mom. Uh, no, uh, um. <laughs> oh shit. My mom. You know what? The keys. Sometimes you just gotta cry some things out. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. It's, it's okay. Everyone involved got their comeuppance eventually. Yeah, eventually. And you're doing your family proud? Yeah. 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 Uh, okay. This dude was very proud of you. Um, hey, there's a McDonald's right around the corner. Why don't we hit that on the way out? <laughs> can I get a happy meal? You can get a happy meal. Okay. Now sit here quietly and eat your happy meal. Hello, I got a Hello Kitty toy. Ooh. <clears throat> What's this? I was hoping you'd gotten my message the first time. Honestly, I thought you'd have learned by now. I just don't take no for an answer. I just kind of beat my head into the wall until it goes my way. <clears throat> Edgeworth, what about your defense? I shot the guy. It's no concern of yours. Guess he hasn't found anyone yet. No, def no, no concern of mine. Take this picture. <laughs> By the picture of this lady, I will be your attorney. Edgeworth? It's only been a matter of hours since you last visited. Yet you've made incredible progress in your investigation. It's almost like I'm pretty damn good at this or something. Ah! I'll admit it. I'm impressed, right? Damn right you are. You were always single-minded in your work, though. Once you start on something, you always see it through, don't you? Yeah. About the DL6 incident. Right. DL6. I didn't want you to find out about it. And that is why I refused your offer to defend me. I'm sorry if it sounded like I thought you weren't up to the job. No, it's okay, I'm used to it. Most people feel that way about me. Oh, that's sad. I just wanted to keep you away from DL6. Shit, I'm sad now. Uh, I mean, though, how did Phoenix at least... I mean, him and uh, Phoenix and Edward are friends, but you're telling me Phoenix doesn't know that Edward's dad got murdered. I mean, they were friends in college, so it's not like... Hi, I'm Edgeworth. My dad got fucking murdered. Did they even establish that it was college and yeah. not just like Larry, grade school? Larry talked about how they were all friends in college. I thought he just said school. He said college. I thought he said college. Because we made because that's what prompted us to make jokes about keggers and smoking weed. Or did we I, just? I don't know. I wasn't. I'm, I, I'm often I, I, not I, I paying enough attention. So, <laughs> shit. Hang on. <laughs> Uh, I don't have the video file up. Never mind. <laughs> uh, so, do you still think it would have been better for me to stay away? I don't know. But... I see no point in hiding anything from you now. Thank you. Very well. Ask whatever you like, and I will answer to the best of my abilities. Yeah, can I be your defense attorney yet? <laughs> That's all I care about. Please, I need money. <laughs> the DL6 incident was when my father died. Damn! 
Right before my eyes. S suddenly a lot of things are making sense. Yeah. He was shot and killed, and I saw it all. Oh. <clears throat> uh, that's awkward. My memories from that time are foggy. I suppose it's a self-defense mechanism. In any case, a suspect was arrested, a man. It's pretty clear he was the only one who could have killed my father. And the spirit medium they used to talk to my late father said the same thing. It was an attorney by the name of Robert Hammond that cleared the suspect's name. Ed Hammond is the victim in the Gord Lake murder? Correct. Um... That spirit medium... That was my mom. <sighs> baggage, man, I'm telling you. They're not baggage! <clears throat> what? You mean your? It's strange. I thought that terrible incident was about to end, and now this. About to end? The DL6 incident happened 15 years ago. Yeah? Fifteen years ago, on December 28th. Yeah? December 28th? The statute of limitations on the case runs out in three days. There's no statute of limitation on murder! There is in this universe! Because this is the same universe where you only have three days for a trial no matter what! So who even fucking knows what counts in this universe anymore? <laughs> I, I mean, literally, murder is like the only thing that doesn't. And, tr and court <laughs> trials aren't on a three-day limit, but here we are. <laughs> also, what a coincidence. This upcoming trial has three days, and the statute of limitations on the case runs out in three days. Yeah. Uh, That's some... What a coincidence. What? That's some good old dramatic writing right there. Um... Nick, what does that mean? What contrivances? When a case of statute of limitations run out, legally, the case never happened. Not quite, but I mean, basically. Yeah, I mean, it, 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 they can't be tried. So yeah. it's like, eh? Three days from now, DL6 will be closed forever. You ever feel like an overly dramatic amount of pressure is on your shoulders? No, just me? Okay. We're not video game protagonists, so... What happened to the suspect? The one who got off innocent? <sighs> yeah. I don't know. He disappeared from public view. Nobody knows where to. If he's still alive, he'd be about 50 years old now. That That's not very old. It's middle-aged. Yeah, but I guess I can understand why he'd go into hiding. I mean, no, it's not like he's very old. He's got a lot of life left, I'm just saying. It's middle yeah, age. Yeah, I mean, if he's still alive, he'd be 50. I mean, 50's not old, Edgeworth. I but 15 mean... years is a lot of time for something to fucking kill you. Yeah, I know. Disease, cars, guns, knives, bare hands, piano wire. Did I say cars? <laughs> Edgeworth getting revenge. Edgeworth getting revenge. Boats, planes, helicopters, stairs, pools, dogs, cats. Bees! 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 Are you saying we should do Hitman next? No. I'm not ready to do a Hitman <laughs> game yet. Oh. Um, so was your father a lawyer? He was. Wasn't she there when she was told that he was a prosecutor or a defense attorney or whatever the fuck? Yes. Yeah. I forgot. Gregory Edgar. <sighs> he was quite famous at the time, apparently. So you were sort of trying to follow in his footsteps. That's so admirable. <laughs> I think you shuck a cord. 
I'd rather not talk about it. You struck a chord. Why not? Uh, 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 uh. Shh. Uh, okay. All right, bud. Does that mean I'm your? Does that mean I'm your attorney now? <laughs> Please. <laughs> Show him your badge. <laughs> Look at me! Damn it! I'm an attorney. Come on. Your attorney's badge. I can't say I really want to see one of those right now. Just accept my request to be your. <laughs> You just start, like, stand up and start banging on the glass. Damn you! I'm gonna be your defense yeah. attorney if it kills me! I'm gonna be a defense attorney and you can't stop me! So, does that mean... What if I just start showing him this shit? Hey, look at this! Mm. Who would have thought there'd be a photo? The lady with a camera? Actually, no, it was yeah. me when I saw the lady with a camera. Yeah. Edgeworth. Did you shoot him? What do you think, right? That, that's not. I don't think I you're had. the. I don't think you're the kind to point a gun at anyone. No. So you didn't shoot him. No, I didn't shoot anybody. I already defended no, myself. Every... Oh. Okay. No, I didn't. It wasn't me. That's all I need to hear. Wasn't him. Right. Huh? It pains me to ask you this now. It is like a constipation face right there. Yeah. I know. You want us to defend you. No, I don't. <sighs> we will be happy to do so. Yes. Will you? Of course we will. What? Same state, you should have told him that. No, guess what? I've decided. No, no, no. This is a moment. We have to be sincere in our defense. Ah, who would have guessed this day would come? Yes, be. Not me. We had, to, we, we had to be totally sincere in all this. Yeah, finally you. I can be sincere and smug all at the same time, Anstika. I'm really <laughs> fucking good at it. This is my chance to finally pay you back. Pay him back? Pay me back. He looks like he got stung by a bee in this portrait. <laughs> for what? I don't remember ever doing anything for you. Never mind. I guess you don't really need to know. Huh. Yeah, it doesn't feel good to get someone shooting cryptic bullshit at you, does it? My letter of request. Please give it to Detective Gumshoe. Oh, hell yeah! Well, I guess we should... Hmm? What's that? The earthquake! Nick! It's a big one! It's calming down. That was scary. You think hugging my ankle's gonna save your life from an earthquake? Uh, yes. Whatever. Mm. Hmm? Huh? Where's Edgeworth? Huh? It's like Batman. Just I think you that. were never meant to defend him in court. I think it's causing the world to try and tear itself apart. It's divine intervention right there! <laughs> yes! Well, you know what? <laughs> Nothing's gonna stop me from defending my client in court. Not even Mother Nature! There. He's on the floor in a ball, shivering. Oh. I guess he doesn't do so well with earthquakes. I'll be damned! I've heard of running, but curling up in a ball? Well, I guess we're done. <laughs> Bye! <laughs> See ya, bud! <laughs> Mr. Edgeworth doesn't seem like he's going to stand up anytime soon. He seems like a mere mortal by the passing second! <laughs> Why does the policeman help bad. him? He's Why just standing the there. Room? He doesn't get paid to help, he gets paid to stand. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go, Nick. See you, Edgeworth. Bye, Edgy. Yeah, uh, right. We have to give Bye, Mr. Mannequin. We have to give Edgeworth a letter of request to Detective Gumshoe. Bye, Edgy. Bye, Detective Mannequin. <laughs> well, that was wild. Hello, Blue Demon. Chief.
What's going on here, C? No, I got myself a client gumshoe. It's the third time today she's been terrified of something. Swear. <laughs> <sighs> you're fine. What, what's wrong, I'm Detective? Fine. You're, you're fine. <laughs> you're fine. <laughs> what's, what's wrong, Detective? This one lady comes in here just a while ago. Here we go. Hang on, let me bust out the newspaper. Alright, carry on. So she come talk y'all after hearing what Mr. Ra had to say. What's this all about, pal? Hey, new Garfield. What? Hmm. A lot of heart. Why are you go around finding more witnesses? You want to give Mr. Edward the death sentence, pal? No, no, not at all. Just, I mean, she did see something. There's nothing I can do about that. I can't go around covering up evidence. It's against the law, and I'll, I'll lose my license. You're trying to say something about the way I do my job? Not this time. You know if I was going to insult you, I'd do it right to your face. Mm, that's true. No, sir! I just, honestly, I'm just here to show you this. After I make sure something I can talk to you about. Oh, damn. Here we go. So, what did Miss Hart say? She says she saw Mr. Edgeworth fire the pistol. I sincerely doubt that, considering how foggy it was. What? She even has a photograph to prove. Right, I saw it too. I think, I think she's lying and making crap up because she's excited, because she had no idea about any of this until you brought it up. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But you really can't tell from the photo who it is shooting. That, that, that's where, why she says so she's going to enlarge the photo. That's not how that works. I gotta... <laughs> whatever. I'll drop it. Digital! Enhance! Enhance! Yeah. Enhance! Digital, 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 uh, 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 I see, I see the, one. I see the suspect in the, in the reflection from that screw. I need a warrant right away. Yeah. She says, it'll drop the quality of my, but, but, but she let us see who's who. She can do that? No. No. That's not how this works. At all. If the photo looks but like this and you enlarge it, it's just gonna look like a puffed up pixely version of that. Yep. Yes. <laughs> that's, that's, that's not how this works. Okay, so there's going to be an enlarged <laughs> photograph that shows uh... Edgeworth in the act. Great. Just great. Instagram. Hello? Did he die? And... I think he's dead. No. Time of death, 11, 11, 11 p.m., 9-15-2018. Rip. 11-12, maybe? Yeah. Damn. I was hoping I could... That joke would stall long enough and he'd be able to say something. Hold on. <laughs> okay. Um... So how do you feel about blue demons? Well, they're really blue and vaguely demonish. Kind of looks like a badger back there, you know. Staring at you. Gumshoe steps to the right. <laughs> I wonder how effective that thing would be as an as a persona. <laughs> like zero. It looks like a it looks like a fucked up Jack Frost. <laughs> uh -huh. Jack Frost. It kind of looks like he's sitting on Gumshoe's shoulder a little bit. Yeah, like, <laughs> what the hell is that on your shoulder, Gumshoe? I think Discord is done having a heart attack. No, that's okay. okay. We were stalling pretty good. Yeah. Go ahead and read your line, okay. pal. <laughs> In any case, there's a, she, 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 she's go going to be... Uh, uh, In any case, she, she's going to be the one testifying tomorrow. The... Huh? What happened to the other witness? 
Well, apparently there was a cancellation. Because apparently you can do that. In uh, court. cancellation? Eh? Me? I, 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 I'm afraid tomorrow is going to be a life or death for poor Mr. For poor Mr. Edge. No, it's going to be life for excellent Mr. Edge. I don't know where. Look, that, that, this is a bad joke. I'm going to drop it now. Yeah. <laughs> we got a witness who, who says she, she, she saw the very moment of the murder. Come on, Gumshoe. Have some faith in me. My, like, M.O. is destroying testimonies that supposedly see the exact moment of a murder. I think he died again. <laughs> no. The blue demon is whispering things yeah. into his ear to say. Oh, hello. And we got a photo taken with the shot ring out. I'd say that sounds like a pretty unwittable case. But wait, what did Mia used to say? If he's innocent, there's gotta be something I've overlooked. He'll be fine! He the Edgeworth actually shot the guy. It sounds like Mr. Edgeworth is going to ask the state to assign a public defender. Uh, I was just asked to file the paperwork. Ah, ah, ah! But you still got time, pal. You go talk to him again. For me, please. You have to convince him. Yeah, 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 yeah. You have to make him let you defend him, please. I know you're the only one who can do it, pal. How do you get the right side of your face to slant like that? I'm impressed. You're the only one who can save Mr. Edgeworth. Can I show you something, buddy? That's the wrong button. Are you not going to talk about the cancellation of the other witness? No. Oh. Yeah, yeah, the cancellation, nope. the witness, the what the hell happened. Like, why? <laughs> Look what I got. It's, it's, hey, you did it, pal. Glad I waited to the last minute to file those papers. Incompetent! Incompetent! Woo! Oh, I'll whip them up and start new ones for ya. Thanks, Detective. Well, see you in court tomorrow, then. Good luck, pal. You too, buddy. <laughs> hey. Straw. You guys feel that earthquake a little while back? Yeah, there's a gremlin hugging my ankle the entire time it happened. I was uh, worried. I'm not a gremlin. You're a gremlin. No. Yeah, you're a gremlin. Worried? You eat all my food, make a mess everywhere, and make loud screeching sounds. You're you're a gremlin. No. See? <laughs> <laughs> gremlin. In defense, that, that that is making you look more and more like a gremlin. See? We're fine. I blurred out. Yeah, I've lived out here my whole life. I'm pretty used to them by now. Pretty used to them, she says. Pretty used to them. <laughs> the only person who felt worse after it was Edgeworth. Uh, I didn't say that. Oh, I wasn't worried about you two. I was worried about Mr. Edgeworth. Oh, yeah, no. He's... Yeah, we just we just left him on the floor. Yeah, he was just kind of he was kind of catatonic, so we just kind of left. Yeah. He did seem to overreact a little now that you mention it. Yeah, well, I'm not surprised. It was a pretty big quick. I'm going to go check on it. Aw, oh, Gumshoe's a bro. Yeah. He is a bro. You two go eat and get rest for tomorrow's trial. <sighs> Later. Later. I already, I already had a happy meal, though. I'm good. You're not hungry? No. It's a Christmas miracle! I am, though. On second thought... Oh. <laughs> Don't screw me out of my Christmas miracle! This is my Christmas miracle, damn it! <laughs> I wonder what it is with Mr. Edgeworth in earthquakes. I wonder. He was never that scared of them when he was in school. And then again, I was only in the same class as him for fourth grade. What the fuck? 
Okay, so it was oh, grade school? Okay. There you go. But yeah. I swear they named college earlier. I think they just thought that because he came up with the joke and it became headcanon. Maybe that was what happened. That I don't know. Quite but Larry's wording seemed very college-y at the very least. It is Larry, though, so maybe he just is that way. Transferred to another school after that. Wonder what happened to Edgeworth. I wonder what happened. Yeah, I wonder what happened. To be continued. I, yeah, but, 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 yeah, it's but, been about but Larry 30 minutes, so that's probably like, the perfect time. Yeah, it's a good stopping point. Yeah. So, yeah. but Larry, yeah. Oh, go ahead. Anyway. No, nothing. Uh, no, go ahead. End of video. No, we got time. Go ahead. <laughs> no, end no. the damn video. No, we usually go like 45 plus minutes. Yeah, we've had ones that went an hour and a half, so taking the extra few minutes to say what you're going to say isn't going to hurt us. <laughs> well, I was going to say it just made. Larry made it sound like they were friends for like a lot longer. Like, hey, like the three of us were hanging out like all the time doing mm -hmm. all this stuff. He did make I it mean, sound pretty. Yet you, yet they knew him for fourth grade. I mean, yeah. uh, that's barely even like counts. Yeah. Alrighty then. That's pretty inconsistent. I'll game. See you for the next video where I don't know. I guess we're going to court. Yeah. Sounds like. Yay, it. court! Court! Yay. Court!